Hey, how are you guys doing? Uh, this special video, I'm heading over to Japan. I'm over at uh, LAX right now, and as you can see, my plane is not here. Here is the gate, but where is my plane? Where's my plane? I'm still waiting for my plane to come in, but uh, as you can see, it's parked right there. And for the next 11 and a half hours of my life, I will be in this plane. That's right, this plane right here. It's 12 hours later and uh, I'm inside my hotel room, or my hotel restroom. Check this out. It looks really weird. What are these buttons on the side? Look at this, like, what's this, what's this, and what is this? And there's like a dial and there's no toilet paper around. This is, this is really weird. What am I going to use? Well, this is the daytime outside of the hotel and it looks exactly like Georgia, but it's Japan. To prove it, let me zoom in there. Let's see, you can see it's in Japanese. Or oh, maybe not. Darn it. Alright, I'm walking the outside grounds of my hotel and um, that's what the hotel's name is called. Excel Hotel Tokyo. And for a couple hundred dollars or three hundred dollars a night, US dollars, you have to stay in a hotel with a Japanese garden that you can walk around. Check this out. So it's just like a museum type of park. There's actually a koi pond down there, a hotel, restaurant that's up here. And here's the hotel pool. I think it's in the shape of a number nine or a number six. Not sure. Or the letter letter B. And guess what? They also sell beer. That's right. Vending machines that sell beer. And it costs 400 yen. So you can get your choice of Asahi. Uh, Sapporo uh, and other flavors along with of course water alright I'm in my uh, tour bus right now with the rest of the tour group and we're traveling down the highway to Tokyo as you can see I guess this everybody is love Hello Kitty so let me check from my office first because I have like um Kind of, uh, you know, it's written in my itinerary that uh, four of you, you're not going to the theme park, so I'm not sure. Let me check. That's right. We're going to Hello Kitty theme park. After like an hour of driving, we're finally in the uh, Tokyo Imperial Palace. Um, this is, I guess, where they're imperial, kind of like the White House of the uh, Tokyo, and that's where the royal family stays. So here are the tourists looking at the statue. So we're gonna take a look at the bridge. That's right here. Oh yeah. Okay. Well, here I am at the uh, entrance of the Imperial Palace, and obviously they don't want people to go in because this sign just says "keep out." So it's not exactly a form of the welcome mat. So I'm walking down a busy Market Street here. As you can see, there's a bunch of people just shopping, filming, taking pictures. And let me turn it around. You can see the 
other side. And it's mostly just shops. Shops on the left. And shops on the right. So. It's pretty busy, as you can see. It's, uh, it's almost noon, and people are coming out for the lunch break. And the coolest thing is Denny's. That's right, they have a Denny's out there too. All right, I'm in front of, guess what? Hello Kitty Land. That's right, our tour group stopped in Hello Kitty Land. I'm just going along with it. And to prove it, Sanrio Puro Land, Sanrino. That's a company that made a Hello Kitty. And to prove it even more, I'm gonna zoom in a little bit. That's right. A place you can't miss.